handbrake broke on my car and I couldn't move out of the right hand lane of the A322. I've been able to phone the police and they were here within 10 minutes and they made sure that I was safe, my car was safe and everyone else on the road was too. So I hope they have a quiet night tonight. Myself and Phil are both just looking out at cars that are going past, anything that might interest us. Uh, listening to jobs on the radio in case there's anything we can help with uh, and also obviously the onboards uh, and county-wide APR systems so if anything activates that were of interest to us uh, then we'll be looking to go and try and get them stopped. So we've stopped a car that's activated our in-car APR system it was initially shown as having a tax expired your vehicle excise license we've established that in fact his license has been revoked so in effect doesn't have a driving license uh, because of that, we'll be seizing the vehicle from him. One sounds like a very minor injury. Uh, it's a good chance for us to get there and breathalyze the drivers and things like that. So. I'm IMPC 3658 Hudson. You are not under arrest and you are free to leave should you wish to do so. Um, as you've been involved in a road traffic police, I'm just going to open this sense of it here. Um, you're going to be breath tested. I'm going to ask you questions which may seem silly, but in the last 20 minutes, have you uh, had any alcohol? Smoked in the last five minutes? So if you were to refuse to give me a sample, you would uh, risk prosecution for that offence. Um, so I'll hold the device, just take yeah. a nice deep breath, yeah. seal your lips around the end of the tube, and then blow out until I tell you to stop oh, whenever nice. you're ready. That's perfect, thank you very much. Now you see, it'll just analyse, but very quick, and it will come up with a result, which is zero, so that's perfect, all right? Thank you very much. Just the saliva from the tongue. We wipe it on these pads here, put it back in the device, and uh, we then release a, a, a liquid, which mixes with the saliva. And then uh, if there is any presence of cocaine or uh, cannabis, uh, we would have a line showing underneath uh, either one of those or in some cases both. We stopped the, the vehicles as you saw just then because uh, the driver had a front headlight out. Ben again was speaking to the driver and he, he could smell alcohol in the driver's breath. Uh, we've carried out a roadside breath test. He has shown us having alcohol in his system but under the required limit. So uh, 35 uh, micrograms per 100 millilitres breath is the limit. He's blown 13, so 1 3. So the uh, gentleman has been uh, given advice about his headlight. He's going to go to a petrol station, get a new bulb for that, and we just have advised him about uh, drinking before going out in his car. I'd say it was a quiet night tonight. Generally, we're stopping people for traffic offences. Often, the, the smallest of traffic offences actually builds up in something slightly larger. If you've had a drink or you're taking drugs, uh, don't get behind that wheel because um, we're out there looking for you and um, the worst case scenario you have an accident and someone gets hurt and uh, the consequences can be quite high.